today let's learn about centimeters meters and kilometers with mandy good morning mom what is that in your hand oh i found a measuring tape on the table there are some numbers written on it mom i have seen such measuring tape before but can't remember where yes my child do you remember we had visited a cloth shop yes mom we saw a person using a measuring tape to measure the cloth for your uniform the numbers on the tape indicate the meters and centimeters we buy cloth in meters and centimeters yes now i remember we also measure our heights in meters and centimeters hmm I got it mom do you remember you and annie had participated in a running race yes mom races are also measured in meters like a 100 meter running race 200 meter running race 400 meter relay race one more important point to learn is that the standard unit of measuring length is meter okay mom I'll keep that in mind. Do you remember I had taught you to convert meters into centimeters? Yes, mom. Let's revise that. 1 meter is equal to 100 centimeters. So, to convert meters into centimeters, we have to multiply the meters by 100. So, For example, to convert 2 meters into centimeters, we have to multiply 2 into 100, which is equal to 200 centimeters. Got it? Come, let me explain you a new term. Kilometer. Kilometer? Yes. Long distances are measured in kilometers. the distance covered by an athlete in a marathon race is in kilometers oh okay i thought it is measured in meters only how many meters make 1 kilometer good question 1 kilometer is equal to 1000 meters mom we write meter in short as m and centimeter in short as cm so do we write kilometers in short as km <laughs> yes its short form is km mandy we also measure the distance traveled by vehicles in kilometers wow mom i got to know something new today the units of length kilometer meter and centimeter